Like so many others, Brian Axelson's life has been touched by cancer. He lost his grandfather to the disease, and his father is a recent cancer survivor. He had to have radiation, and, and uh, thankfully they caught it in time, and they were able to get it, get it out, get radiation. He had to have a little bit of reconstructive surgery, but he's fine. He's doing well. His dad and granddad are his reasons for putting so much energy into his Man of the Year campaign for Augusta's Leukemia Lymphoma Society. The annual competition pits 12 men and women against each other to raise as much money as possible for the organization. I was like, do I have time for this? And I thought, you know what? It's 10 weeks out of the year and it's an am amazing cause. Of course I've got time for this. Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Dub. We are gearing up for a big time. May the 5th at the Bell Auditorium. New Country Brian is Dub of the Kicks Wake Up crew with Mike and Jenny on Kicks 99. Dub is working as country music contacts using his Nashville connections to raise money for his campaign. I've got some uh, tickets for our guitar pull, which is one of the biggest shows of the year, and an autographed guitar from last year's uh, guitar pull. Some of the proceeds from the Billy Currington concert at the Bell Auditorium May 5th will go to Dub's Man of the Year campaign and and he's raffling off a chance for a meet and greet with the country music singer. Raffle tickets are $5 at the April 27th Green Jackets game. It all worked out to where we could get Billy at the Bell Auditorium for a show and uh, we were able to do the LLS tie-in as well. So it was basically people are going to get to go and buy a ticket and have a great time at a great show and they're going to be able to help out a great cause as well. Each dollar that comes in pumps Dub up and pushes him toward his total that will be announced at the grand finale May 19th. What's your fundraising goal? Oh. As, as much as possible. That's, that's what I, because, you know, I, I've talked to people and they said, well, you know, I, th I think you can win this thing. I said, you know, it'd be, a, it'd be an honor to win. But the thing is, is we're all helping the same goal. We've got a bunch of little pots that are all going to be dumped in the big pot and it's all going toward LLS. And so I would love to win, but I just want to raise as much money as I can for this wonderful cause.